guys, what's up? I'm Crazy okay, iPods here. Today, uh, I'm, I'm just going to be d showing you how to jailbreak your 4.1 device. So, it was a program called Snowbreeze. So, just go to the link in the description. It's down there, it, and just download Snowbreeze. But before you download your firmware, may, uh, check the description because it will tell you what what things you'll need for your device. And make sure you read it so you know. Then what you want to do is once you've got your firmware and once you've unzipped Snowbreeze, you might need to change this from it might be in a where is it there? You might that might be in a um, zip file, so you might need to change that to IPSW. So you just instead of um, zip, you just change it to IPSW. And then what you want to do, this will come up once you open up Snowbreeze, and it'll say this software is. For commercial use, if you've bought the software, demand a refund, and blah, 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 blah. So you just go OK and click Next. And then you want to select, select um, Expert Mode and go Next. And then you want to find your IPSW. Mine is on my desktop, so I'm just going to put it in. Oh, it's there then. Right there. So this process it, processing. Okay, so it's finished processing, and then if you are 2G, uh, you will get this message, and this is very important, so you need to check if you're MB model or MC model. If you're MB, you'll be untethered, that means you will not need a PC to boot, and if you are MC, that means you will be tethered, um, you'll need a PC to boot. So I am MB, but I'm just going to show you how you check. So you just go onto your iPod. I'm not going to be going through this entire thing because, as you can probably see here, I am jailbroken and I am on 4.1. So you just go to general and then you go to about and then you can see right there I am. I'm not sure what's wrong with the vision at the moment. I am MB. Right there. And then you can see I'm 4.1. And MB, yeah. So, and then what you want to do is you just want to click MB or MC and then click next. And then you want to click general and go next. And this is where you can choose what stuff you want. So, you could, if you have an iPhone, you can activate it. And I'm just going to click enable background wallpaper, barrier percentage, native multitasking, and uh, yeah, that's all at the moment. So, then you can add all your custom apps or sources here. Uh, just you can add whatever ones you want, and this is where you can add a custom boot logo. So I'm going to add a custom boot logo, and you can add verbo uh, enable verboost mode, which means it comes up with all this writing instead of the Apple logo. Oh, hold on, not that one. And then you can just choose your one. So I'm going to have this one loads up I'm going to show you. So it has this little thing. It is the Zelda boot logo. And then you just want to go build IPSW and click next. And once it is finished building you will have it right here and it will be called Snowbreeze and then your device type. So you can do not get it mixed up with your other ones. And then what you want to do is you just want to open up iTunes wherever it is. I've got iTunes 10. Open up. Sorry, I'm on my XP, so it's not very fast. So this is an XP jailbreak, and I will have uh, Windows 7 jailbreak very shortly. Ah, uh, sorry, not a, uh, a Mac jailbreak very shortly. Okay, and then once iTunes comes up, you want to plug in your device, and um, since I've already jailbroken, I'm not going to do this, but then when you're plugged in, what you want to do, I'm just going to try and put my tripod on here, what you're going to want to do, what you're going to want to do, I'll show you right now, is you want to put it into D 
the FU mode, and I'm just going to show you how to do that for all you new people. And what you want to do is you want to hold, you want to turn your device off, so you just want to, and if you don't know how to do that, then you just hold this button down, and then slide to power off. And then once you've done that, you want to hold down the top button for about three seconds, and then um, hold down both of the buttons, the home button and the um, power sleep button for about 10 seconds and then let go of the power button and continue holding the home button and then you should get this thing saying your iPod is in recovery mode and you have to restore so once you've got that what you want to do is you just want to go like this you want to find you you want to go onto iTunes and you just click instead of clicking restore you click shift I'll show you here shift left click restore and it'll come up with this little menu and you get to choose what firmware you want and you choose your custom firmware okay so so that's how you jailbreak guys and once you've finished um, you should have a jailbroken device and you should have an app just like that Cydia okay so thanks for watching guys if you have any problems whatsoever please comment below and I should be able to help you Okay, thanks for watching guys, and I'll see you guys later. Peace.